What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Aries, and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading. For all signs, Captain said to everybody in between, don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. For sign of Aries. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. Um... If you'd like to donate, it's 5 Priestess Tarot 5. The link's in the description box below. Thanks for all the love and support to the channel. Thanks for all the new subscribers. If you'd like to book a personal reading, the link's in the description box below. Uh, most of them are filled, but if you would like, if you're interested, you have to text me to book, and um, I'll tell you the slots available. There's a new service called Life Coaching if anybody's interested in that as well. Okay, so um, this is for the sign of Aries. Um, this can resonate if you have Aries in any aspects of your chart. I encourage everybody to check out their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, and Manhattan your charts for additional message or messages. And I received one channel message as I was meditating on your week two energy for October of 2022, Aries. And I heard paranormal activity. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Uh, paranormal activity. So you plug it in, how I think one of you guys is experiencing paranormal activity. Or somebody you're connected to is experiencing paranormal activity. Um, or so, or you like investigating paranormal activity or something of that nature. Some kind of paranormal activity. However that resonates and applies. Maybe for some you're a ghost hunter. You plug it in how it resonates, Aries. Firefly. Share messages. You have to plug it. A secret relationship, ancestral relationship between two cousins is about to be exposed very publicly. They do not want it being exposed, but it's about to be exposed. For one, you are one of the cousins. Oh, a secret ancestral relationship between two cousins is about to be exposed soon. Um, very publicly. And I heard for one of you guys, you are one of the cousins. So one of you guys is in some kind of secret ancestral relationship with your cousin. For one, you may not be, but um, it's about to be exposed very publicly. Um, and if you're the one in the secret ancestral relationship with your cousin, you don't want it exposed. I'll tell you that right now. So you play, uh, well, you shouldn't have sex with your family. If anybody needs to hear that. It's about to cause huge shakeups in this family. And one very awkward upcoming family reunion. It's about to cause huge shakeups in this family. And one very awkward upcoming family reunion is what I heard. I'm, I'm sure it will be an awkward family reunion if they choose to go. Yikes. Number seven could be a very significant number in one's life. Number seven, it could be a possible age of viewer, somebody you're connected to, or any other significant number. For one, you're not in the secret ancestral relationship with your cousin. For one, you are. So only you know if you are or aren't. But... If you are, just know it's about to get exposed very publicly. I don't feel it's going to be you about to do this. <laughs> Yikes. That, that. Hashtag stay, uh, stay away from your cousins. Firefly. For some, you can be dealing with fire sign. You have double fire sign energy here. If you are, they can have Aries, Leo, Sag, and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, 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 Jupiter charts. You plug in how it resonates, Aries. Firefly. A very awkward family reunion is about to become very significant in Aries' life. For one, you're not going to go. For one, you will hear about it. For one, you will be there. Oh my God, heavy family reunion energy. If this resonates for you, family reunion energy strong. For one, you're going to go. You're going to free willing choose to go. For one, you're not going to be there. And for one, uh, you're going to hear about it. So buzz, 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 buzz about this family reunion. I heard it's going to be very awkward, but I think it's 
because some kind of kissing cousins are about to be revealed. And that's just the truth. Um, shining the light on the kissing cousins. Um, and that could be how it's about to go public. Is that this family reunion? For one, you could shed the light on the kissing cousins. Only you know which side you're on here. Um, whoa. There's about to be an explosion of a huge building soon. A huge building. For one, you're going to be near this. For one, you're going to be in this. For one, you're going to hear about it. Oh, my God. There's about to be an explosion of a huge building soon. For some, you're going to be in the building. You're going to be in the building. For some, you're going to be near the building. For some, you're going to hear about this explosion. It's a huge building. So, I wonder which building it is. Uh, it might, I wonder if it's like the Empire State Building or something like that. I didn't hear it was. But... Some kind of huge building like the Empire State Building. I didn't hear it was, but some kind of large building. Very large building. One, you're going to be in the building. One, you're going to be near the building. One, you're going to hear about the explosion. So light being shed on the explosion of the huge building upcoming. Holy crap moly. Crocodile. A very predator, predatory, drag queen is about to be exposed. For one, you're going to help expose it, expose this person. For one, you're going to be shocked when they're exposed. A very predatory drag queen is about to be exposed. For one, you're going to help expose this person. For one, you're going to be shocked when they're exposed. So I, I think the predatory drag queen, I think they prey on children. I think they prey on children. There's a reason I heard they're predatory. I think they're like the crocodile children. They lurk, they stalk, they stalk their prey, which is children. They like the young energy. They like the young goodies. Um, and that's sick to say, but it's the truth. For one, you're going to help expose them. For one, um, you're going to be shocked when they are exposed. So I think you know they're a predatory energy to children. And you've kept your mouth shut on it. Um, you plug it in how it resonates, Aries. An exercise machine is just about to quit working. And a pinball machine. Just out of the blue. Very new devices. You're going to be in awe of why. Shock of why. Okay, a pinball machine and a new exercise machine. It sounds like they're both new equipment, if that um, resonates for you. A pinball machine and an exercise machine. Um, both fairly new equipment, so they're not old, oldie but goodies. They're new, fairly new. I heard they're just about to quit working out of the blue. They're just about to quit working. I heard you're going to be a shock and awe of why. You know why. You know why. You know why. So you do know why. You're going to be a shock and awe of why. But I heard you do know why. So whatever reason, it could be a paranormal activity for some. For some, it could be some other reason why they're just about to quit working. Um, a pinball machine and an exercise equipment machine. It sounds like both very expensive items. Confirmation for my kidding. Wind chimes, peace and harmony.
And Aries is about to start staying at home. Getting out of the workforce, about to start staying home. Okay, so one of you guys is about to get out of the workforce and you're about to start staying home is what I heard. So I think it's going to make you happy to stay home. You're about to get out of the workforce and it's going to create peace and harmony in your life to stay home. Um, however, that resonates and applies. Uh, you're still in the workforce if this resonates for you, but you're about to create series of chain events so you can stay home. Um, and it's going to create peace and harmony and balance in your life. Um, beautiful. Through many series of chain events, a uh, peaceful resolution, child support with the water sign is about to, about to come in soon. Okay, through many series of chain events, a peaceful peaceful, resolu peaceful resolution, water sign masculine, a water sign masculine with the water sign masculine is about to come in, uh, child support. So I think water sign masculine owes you child support. If that resonates and applies for you, um, Aries. And it sounds like he's about to come through on the child support. He could have a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and a Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Mid, Hammer, Jupiter, Charts. I feel you could have one of his children or two or two plus of his children. But it's about to create peace and harmony with the child support um, here. And it's going to make you happy because you're going to have extra fundage to care for y'all's child or children. And absolutely. Major challenges to overcome. Someone's addiction is about to take their life. Through many series of chain events, there's about to be a funeral soon. For one, you're going to attend this funeral. For one, you're not. Okay, I heard someone's addictions are about to take over their life. Um, so, it sounds like they're about to overdose. They're about to OD. Or they're about to drink themselves into a bottle. Um, or it could be sex addictions or something like that. And then um, they ended up with like... HIV or something, it turns into AIDS, and then that takes their life or something like that. Um, but somehow somebody's addictions are about to end their life, whether it's sex addictions and turns into like HIV, then AIDS, and that ends it, or drinking themselves into a bottle, or they overdose. Um, for one, you're going to attend the funeral. For one, you're not. So you plug it in how it resonates. Major challenges to overcome is them um, about to succumb to their addictions, whether it's drugs, alcohol, or sex, or Whatever it is. But it sounds like they are about to do it to themselves. I didn't hear anything else. Dog far away. I'm sorry. Yeah. Distant friend is thinking of you. An Aries popular online social media platform, Feminine Energy Reader, she's about to get overrun with a lot of karmic masculines. They're going to try to come in as divine masculines. Beware. They really want your money, but they're not going to come off this way. Oh my God. You plug in how it resonates, Aries. You're a popular online social media platform, Tarot Reader, if that resonates for you. Um, you're about to have a plethora of actual or karmic masculines about to come in, um, trying to woo you, basically. They're going to try to woo you. Um, I heard they the, fall, the pretense on this is they really want your money, but they're not going to come off like they want your money. So I think they're going to come off like they're stable, grounded, dependable, mentally stable, the whole package, basically. But the false pretense of this is they really want your money. So, um, and it's not just one person about to do this. It's a many masculines, many. 
You are Aries fam and you have a very popular online social media platform if that resonates for you. So major challenges to overcome. I think is uh, if you're interested in a relationship, really picking out the quality versus the quantity here. Um, if you are single and available, okay? Um, whoever you are, you're popular and I, I think they know you make good money or they think you make good money. But it's a lot of masculine energy is about to do this, like a plethora. It's not just one or two. So, so somebody needs to be careful. So picking and choosing who you want to date if you want to date. Confirmation from my kitty. He, he went off all day. Dog far away. A distant friend is thinking of you. An Aries is about to get communication from someone that does not live in their area. Old time friend. For some, it's going to be several people. From long ago, you have positive connection with them. It's going to be nice to hear from them. Well, that's beautiful, Aries. So if that resonates for you, for some, it sounds like it's one person about to reach out to you. For some, it's going to be two or two plus. But it's people that you were positively connected to in the past. It can be anybody. Um, but, um, I heard it's gonna be nice to hear from them. So it's gonna be some kind of positive connection and whatever connection you have with them in the past, it was positive. So they're thinking of you now, or they're about to start thinking of you and they're going to reach out to you for some, it's one for some, it's two or two plus, um, it's positive people you were connected to in the past. An Aries that's living in a home they should not be living in. Through many series of chain events, they're about to be forced to evict. Alabama, Louisiana, Florida, Tennessee. Alabama, Louisiana, Florida, Tennessee is what I heard. Alabama, Louisiana, Florida, and Tennessee. One of you guys lives in a home that you should be living in. And through many series of chain events, you're about to be forced to evict. I heard there's four different states in there. Alabama, Louisiana, Florida, and Tennessee. So uh, I feel you can live in these states, um, is what I feel, in a home you're not supposed to be living in. Uh, but I heard through many series of chain events, you're about to be forced to evict whether you want to or not. So, uh, you know, I don't feel you're like under the Section 8 voucher program, like the legal Section 8 voucher program, not no Section 8 voucher fraud shit. Um, uh, you're literally living there, and you know you're not supposed to be living there, um, whoever you are, and you're about to be forced to evict. So... Uh, major challenges to overcome is the eviction here, but I heard you're not even supposed to be living there anyways, but I think you know you're not supposed to be living there if that resonates for you. Happiness. It's going to work out for everybody in the long run. It's going to work out better for everybody in the long run is what I heard. It's going to work out better for everybody in the long run. So just know you'll probably be pissed when you have to evict, but in all fairness, you shouldn't have even been living there to begin with. And I heard it's going to work out better for everybody in the long run. So just know that. Happiness. A trip to the mountains is about to become very significant and a trip to the ocean. A trip to the mountains and a trip to the ocean is about to become very significant. Man, I think uh, the mountains or the ocean brings you happiness. Mountains and ocean brings me happiness and that's just the truth. So a trip to the mountains and a trip to the ocean um, is about to make you very happy. Hell yeah, me too. Just saying, just saying. Uh, whoever's going to the mountain or the ocean. Take me, take me, take me, take me, take me. Just saying. All right. Let me see if I hear anything else. A pregnant Aries is significant. A Taurus and a Libra is significant in an Aries life. A pregnant Aries is significant and a um, Taurus and a Libra is significant in an Aries life. So whoever the Taurus and Libra is in one of you guys' life, they are significant in your life in some shape or fashion. 
it could be affiliated to be Mask or Force or Libra. They could have Force or Libra in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Moon, Moon, Hammer, Jupiter charts. Whoever they are and how they apply. And um, what are you guys afraid? So you plug it in, how it resonates. I love you guys so much. I hope this helped and resonated. And I love you. Namaste.